and you hit cut to bring it over to the live. We're live, everybody. Shut up. Woo-hoo! Shut up, Jesus and Santa. Hey, everybody. Hi. Welcome to the God Pod. Ladies and gentlemen and celestial beings of all realms, gather around and bear witness to the glorious spectacle unfolding within the God Pod. I, the almighty streamer, have materialized in your digital realm to deliver divine entertainment and unleash a torrent of laughter upon your mortal senses. Prepare yourselves, for the heavens have never been this hilarious. (laughs) I'm God. Thank you so much for joining me on the show once again. We've got a fun show for you today. We've got the top 10 funny games for God to play on Twitch, world news, the adventures of young Jesus, what would Jesus do, and at the end, a new commandment. That's right. That's right. So uh, let me introduce my co-host for the day. I'm here with Jesus and Santa. Hey, everybody. Hello. Ho, 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 ho. Welcome, welcome. It's great to be here. Oh, oh it's, it's great to be here. It is great. We're live on Twitch. Oh. And we're here with... Look at this. Look at all these people that have joined already. There's Boris. There's Chocololo. Laura. Lorez. Hi. You sound like fake Homunculus people to is me. here. Homunculus Boomer is here. She says, yay, fun shit at work. No pants ever. I don't know if that's a he or she or they. It's fine. Kev Larson says, you can never have too many commandments. And Peyton J420 is here. Hi, everybody. This is, we just joined. We've already got a bunch of people watching. This is pretty cool. This is very cool. Hey, hold and on. I... One, one, one second, please. Hey, you well? Oh, I was, see, I was trying to do something there. Okay, <laughs> go on. <laughs> I mean, you did lean. It kind of half worked. Hey, hey, you elves, get back to work. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm that happy worked again. Fantastic. <laughs> I'm such a pro at this. You know, Santa isn't up here in heaven with us. As we can see here, he's in the North Pole, and this is the first time we're getting to see him moving on camera for me and God. It's very exciting. I think this is the first time we're really seeing you, Jesus. I guess we did a Facebook Live once. We did, and yeah, yeah, I I think we went live once. Yeah, yeah, well, you weren't ready yet. We didn't have a camera sent over to you just yet, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, 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 gotcha. Oh, he winked. <laughs> oh. Pause for wink. <laughs> uh, Jira Rudolph Arena Bill says, hey, God, and Marzipan is here. All of our friends are here. I've been hanging oh. out with them. Yeah. Santa, I can barely hear you. Can you lean into your mic more? Or I don't know. Yeah, sure. Here. How's this? Is this better? That yes. is better, I think. Just yell more. Okay, I will. <laughs> <laughs> Ginger Snap says, hello, God. How are Jesus and Santa? How are you, dudes? Doing well. You know, we're good. Yeah. Today <laughs> is, and the humans can confirm this, truly a merry Monday. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yeah. No denying it today. And I mean, says, sin- Go ahead, since Jesus. we are live, we can maybe get some requests from listeners in terms of what they might want from santa this year oh, or maybe, uh... that's right we can do lots of things we're we're actually yeah so so for those of the uh for everyone lives listening on the podcast in the podcast land in the future um yeah we're recording this live on twitch.tv slash the god pod yes yeah, so call in is... <laughs> call in from the future so this so you can always go there and watch uh the replay of the video and we'll post some clips on youtube but this is a new thing we just started doing this weekend jesus i i went live three times whoa nice like what were you doing one That's to a lot two of hours at a time yeah well the first two nights i play well the first night i played the sims Oh, perfect. And I made a little version of me, God Jr., Jehovah God Jr., and it was a lot of fun. You can watch that. I think you tuned in a little bit, right, Jesus? 
I did watch for a little bit. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. It's what a what a premise. God plays the Sims. He's controlling virtual me. beings. <laughs> and I made a little version of me. He looks just like me. He's he's in his apartment, like playing. I'm playing the Sims, watching me playing the Sims. It's so funny. Like I like how you made yourself in the game. You couldn't just Thanks. stick with humans. You had to make yourself God in yeah, the Sims. I could have. You know, I could have made because I could have made like Job, and then just totally screwed over his life again. But you know, <laughs> it, it's so funny. This thing. I'm watching myself on the screen. And uh, look, if, because I'm kind of cut off, you can only see a third of me. Look, when I'm shrugging, it kind of looks like I'm, you know, doing something else. It looks like a dance move, kind. I'm going to solo guess, yeah. you for a second. Oh, yeah. There yeah. you go. Oh, hey, Merry <laughs> Christmas. Hey, wait, let me try my surprised face. Mm. <laughs> that wasn't that different. <laughs> Hold on, let me, try my, let me try my angry face. Oh, naughty, naughty. That's naughty. good. Oh, that's cool. Naughty. You can solo people. I didn't know that, Jesus. Yeah, you yeah. can solo. All right, now yeah, I'm not, let's, let's solo not Jesus. angry anymore. There you go. There I am. Oh. What's mm -hmm. up, everybody? Woohoo! Yeah. That's all I got. All right, so now let's um, go back to me. Okay, so... great. <laughs> what are you we can also <laughs> feature comments, too, remember? <laughs> oh, oh yeah. yeah. We can feature comments. Hopefully they're yes, not rude. good point. Can you do that, Jesus? Yeah, sure. <laughs> like this one says, "Love gay Jesus." Oh, hey. thanks so much. Welcome, Belly Bean. Hey, Thank you. eat gay love. <laughs> <laughs> Pride season's coming up, and the rainbow sash is out. Is it? Nice. Is it June? That's the Gay Pride Month. Oh, I you like really when, have to ask. You know, I yes. like when is, businesses. Right? Yeah. Yes, I like when businesses do stuff for Pride and then don't do it for the rest of the year. I, I think right. that's nice. Like CVS, <laughs> you know, CVS celebrates Pride, and then and then for the rest of the year, it's like, eh, fuck them. June first, yeah. the profile pictures are updated with rainbows on social media. Then June thirtieth at eleven fifty nine p.m., they come down. And it's hey, back we got to a new comment caring. here. This one's for you, Santa. Ooh. It's from Sam and Joe, and it says, "Eat Santa's ass." Hey, oh my! Look at that! I, I am a fan of eating the old ass. <laughs> <laughs> it's someone after your heart, Santa. <laughs> I mean your ass. Eh, what can you do? <laughs> Amunculus <laughs> Boomer says, "I see father, son, and holy butt stuff guy." Holy oh, wow. butt stuff. I wow. guess Santa's the holy butt stuff guy. Oh, People oh, know yeah, you like right, butt. Because you and and um uh Mrs. Claus, you know. Yeah. I believe We've uh talked about it before. Santa likes to bring it bring up the stinker, as he calls oh, it yes, from time to time. Right. Yeah, a little so. bit. <laughs> Getty says, Yay, this makes my Monday great. Hey, what are you, tigers or something? Yeah. <laughs> Jira has a question. What about the Catholic Answers Counterfeit Christ book? I appreciate LGBTQIA plus people in church, but hmm. Jesus still doesn't want them to sin, right? What? I'm a little confused by the question, Jira. Catholic yeah, Answers counterfeit, counterfeit Christ. Christ book. Yeah. I, a little, yeah, that's a little, know. that's a head scratcher. Look. That's, <laughs> that's some good that's the head scratcher santa can i Anytime. just say i'm so proud of so proud of you oh, he's on it you. with the puppeteering let me tell I you mean, the movement. i mean yeah with the moving his hands to hey, touch himself hey say something uh say something profound for a second ask a question like a, a this a, too a, shall a... pass hmm that's a head scratcher <laughs> <laughs> i mean yeah <laughs> All right. Well, also, if you want to support this show, besides following us on twitch.tv slash the God pod or subscribing to the God pod for free on any podcasting app, you can also support our show at patreon.com slash God pod and join the uh, discord. You can also join our discord. Woo! The link is in yep. the description of this and every episode. I think a lot of the our fans here today are from our discord and every and Thursday we exchange nudes. <laughs> Sexy Thursday. And Chocololo on top of it in the comments with the link. There you go. Ooh, thank you. Good work. All right. So let's get going with the show. 
I came up with the top 10 list today, the top 10 funny games for God to play on Twitch. Hmm. Really quick, someone started? said, um, I'm sorry to interrupt, someone just said Jesus is having bandwidth issues. I thought Fleetwood Mac was a bandwidth issues. Okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know. So good. What, what are you seeing? But I did just switch it, it to 7... It a little seven... blurry. It does, it does okay. get a little blurry. I just switched to 720p. Maybe it'll be better. This is our first time, okay? So, go easy on us. Remember, remember your first time? Uh, so oh, you know awkward. I mean? Yeah. How long did it last? Still going. 30 seconds. Still 30 going. seconds? That, yeah. Yeah, me too. Jesus. 30 seconds. <laughs> if that. But how if wonderful. That. How wonderful. The first time, my first time, it was with Eve. And I, I have said too much. I was trying to show them how to do it, and I was just learning myself. Anyway, uh -huh. <laughs> some good blasphemy for you. She was like, hey, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. You were like, hey, even I will show you again, Adam. And Adam's like, I don't need any more demonstrations. And like, oh, just, <laughs> just one more time, just to make sure. And now, and now Eve, I'm going to show you how to peg Adam. Yeah. And Adam was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, here's a here's a question. Oh, that's actually more of a comment. Rev Mojo One says, "My first time podcasting with God, Jesus, and Stanta. Still Who? waiting. Still waiting on what? Well, we were just first talking about our first time streaming. I think that's what that's in reference to. Oh, and, yeah. that's yeah. a head scratcher. Well, <laughs> <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. It's time for Sam top ten. Uh, yeah, hit us. Go ahead. Yeah." It's time for top 10 funny games for me, the Lord thy God, to play on Twitch. Let's see. Number one on the list is The Sims. Hmm. <laughs> Check. This is funny. Done. I asked, I asked ChatGPT, as I do a lot of things these days. It's really, it's really filling in the gaps for some of my missing omniscience, you know? Mm hmm Yeah. So I asked it, and number one is The Sims, which is great because that's the game that... <laughs> that I've been playing the most. It's uh, it's fun, I get to control the lives of unsuspecting sims. And uh, yeah, I got mine a job at Burger King to start, low, nice low <laughs> And then I uh, got a job in QA. Oh, okay. Trying, I wanna become an esports gamer. Oh, that's cool. In, in real life and in the game. That would be cool. Uh, I also tried this game called Rust Jesus. Rust. Yeah, it, it confused the crap out of me. It drops you into the world buck-ass naked. Oh, man. So I was a woman Hot. in my bush. And, Let me and tell you something. That's a head-scratcher. <laughs> <laughs> I think Santa found his favorite move here. In yeah, the you did. <laughs> I, also played, uh, I also played some Elder Scrolls online. Okay. Oh, oh, nice. And I asked out this hot elf. And she did not respond, so I think Aww. that was no. You know, uh -huh. to be, to no, be I fair, know. all scrolls are elder. They're not really making new scrolls. Mm. <laughs> good point. <laughs> good point. Good point. Good point. All right, this is a good time to remind everybody, if you came here from social media and you want to help us support the show, go back and like that post or retweet it or repost it or share it or whatever. S tell a friend about this feed so that we can, you know, get some more eyeballs. We're we're three animated deities. Well, two deities and one I don't know what Santa is an elf. I'm a I'm a <clears throat> knight. Um hey, someone asked me a question. And then and then, you know, spread it around. Tell yeah. your friends. Who does uh, number two on me? the list. Let me just oh. get through this list. Oh my bad. Job number two, Job Simulator. God could hilariously simulate various jobs, showcasing divine incompetence and mundane tasks while providing humorous commentary. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, I read this wrong. It's Job Simulator. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say. <laughs> job Simulator I can do with The Sims. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Number three, I Am Bread. Is that a game? Oh, I Am is Bread. A, is that a oh, real man. game? <clears throat> God if takes on is. the role of a sentient slice of bread the struggle to navigate and toast itself in unconventional ways would provide comedic entertainment. Honestly, Jesus, I think this is a game that you've played quite a bit. Yeah, I, I, yeah, right. Because of the communion, Cause you've shown, you're saying? Cause you've, because you've shown up in toast so much. 
Oh, <laughs> oh right. I mean, it would be satisfying. That was a head scratcher. Yeah. A head scratcher. <laughs> I wouldn't mind a game like this where you like butter bread and you get that satisfying sound of a knife on a crispy piece of toast. Like mm. that that could be therapeutic in Ew. my opinion. Plus, in remember, the words of Oprah, I love bread. I remember love in Lord bread. of the Rings when Bilbo said that he felt like but, uh, um a piece great. of toast with too little butter <laughs> yes. too thin. Man, that when he said that, I was like, oh damn, I, I, I feel that. What so about relatable. His, what about when his face turned gross? Gah! Yeah, that was. I felt Gah! that too. <laughs> okay, let's get let's get on with the list. Number four, Katamari Damacy. I love that game. Hmm. Have you ever played that, Jesus? No. Yeah, you roll a that? sticky ball around oh, yeah. and collecting objects and people, just crushing them. And the more that you collect, the bigger your ball gets. Oh. Yeah, that's pretty fun. Fun. Um, Sounds like five. a snowball. Octodad Dadliest Catch. I have not heard of this game. Octodad Dad. Yeah, God attempts to navigate the challenges of being an octopus disguised as a human father. Okay. Never heard of. Never heard of that. Are these real games? I don't know. Some, <laughs> Some of, of these are. are. are they they yeah. have to be, because these are real. Surgeon Simulator. Watch Ooh. God hilariously fumble through. <laughs> Through surgeries, that's <laughs> with divine good. Imp with divine imprecision leading to unpredictable and human. That's really good. That is really good. Let me tell you, if I were to do, if I were to try to be a surgeon, there would be a lot of dead humans. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. Did it's you always lose thing. an operator? The Milton Bradley board game. Uh, no, that operator. game. That game is not that hard. You know. If you got steady Speak for hands. yourself. Okay, so yeah. maybe you are good. You maybe you would be good at surgeon I've simulator. I've tried to play actual surgeon simulators, and I just pro. make one. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I prep the area, and then I make one <laughs> cut, and they just bleed out. <laughs> I don't. Uh, I don't even need the game. Anytime I want to play a little operation, I just use one of the elves. Oh no! Uh, oh, what can you? You're do? lying. Santa, I don't believe you, okay? Santa, I think that you are making that up and that inside you're a sweetie pie. Aww. I don't think you would ever hurt an elf. Yeah, yeah you'd like to think that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, number seven, Untitled Goose Game. Now, this God. is real. Yeah, these are all real. Yeah, It has been confirmed I in the chat. They're all real games. I have played this game. Basically, you're just trying to capture a goose. It went viral online a couple years ago. You um, yeah, I, so I like it from the perspective of like you playing a viral game, but I don't really see why you should be playing this one in particular. Yeah, well, God could embody a mischievous goose using divine powers to annoy and confuse NPCs in an unsuspecting mm. village. But if you want, I could replace this one with Plague, Inc., that's plague the game that Inc. I yeah. That's I'm, the game where you make a plague. Oh, I thought you were yeah. saying play gink, and I'm like, I've never played gink. <laughs> no, plague. Yeah, it's uh, that one might hit a little too close to home though. Yeah, yeah. it does seem up your alley though. Read the room, God. Right. Number eight, Goat Simulator. What? <laughs> God controls a goat in a glitchy sandbox world. Absurd and humorous situations would arise. Okay, yeah. I I mean, do the goats get sacrificed to God? Because that would be ironic. It would be. <laughs> Number nine, Manual Samuel. God ex could experience the hilarity of controlling a character's bodily functions manually. Oh, okay. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my. Uh, these are a lot of these games I haven't heard of. And finally, Job the Leprechaun. In Number ten, in this quirky platformer, God plays as a mischievous leprechaun causing chaos while collecting gold. Ha! Okay. I mean, you know, we'll see. Some of these are good. Some of these, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, you should also play SimCity, which I realize is close oh, really? to The Sims, but yeah, of course. I or, think uh, uh, the game that I would play is City Skylines. That's ooh. the game. That... Oh, God, I've been wanting to play that. Tycoon. <gasps> oh, I love Roller Coaster Tycoon. tycoon. I, that yes. could be, I love that, too. It's so uh, fun to play these. I love the simulation games. They're so like chill. 
Nothing impresses girls at a bar more than like a 38 year old going, Remember Roller Coaster Tycoon? <laughs> <laughs> hey, that I, game is held up. You can play the classic still on iPad know. and iPhone. Nothing, nothing that, gets but, a girl wetter than saying, Hey, remember Snick? <laughs> remember, <laughs> remember the lineup? Do you like play? Oh, you know what game I want to play online? Civilization. Ooh. Okay, I haven't yeah, played that, I but I know like what I you're talking start about. With the, is, you haven't played Civilization? You haven't no. played Jesus. Ah, uh, I know. I, I could know. like start with the Israelites. Yeah. <laughs> is it anything like Plinko? <laughs> no. <laughs> a little more complicated than Plinko. Or didn't Ooh. you play Tropico, God? I remember you saying you I played love Tropico. Tropico. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> that's like SimCity. So let's go to some comments here. Marzipan says, still looking forward to God playing Smite. Yeah. I actually went out. This is how addicted I am to Twitch already, Jesus. I went out <laughs> this weekend and spent fifteen hundred dollars. No. On yes, on an eleven hundred on a new PC and four hundred <laughs> on a Nintendo Switch. With <laughs> you bought Legend a Switch. Of Zelda. Yes. With Legend, Legend of Zelda. Yes. Oh, oh, did you start it yet? No. Oh. I, I still. I need the Geek Squad to come help me set it up because I'm old. It's an Nintendo have Switch. Geek Squad come and set up a Switch. <laughs> okay, not the easier. Switch. The, oh. the computer with the capture card so that you can play it on oh. Twitch and all oh, that. Oh, got it. Okay. This was just yesterday. I haven't had time to you know play okay. the Twitch on its own. Geek all right. Squad. Um, Geek, one of Geek Squad's key tenants of their business is they don't wipe their feet. Oh wow! <laughs> so they come in and they just smell awful and yeah, leave and they that stench. Mud. Yep. Ugh. We don't the wipe our feet, Geek Squad. We uh, Rev Mojo One says, "I think genital jousting belongs on that list." Ooh, yikes! Is that a real game? That's um, <laughs> genital jousting. That just sounds like a euphemism for sex. For for docking. It doesn't mm -hmm. sound very mm -hmm. pleasant. There was this other comment that Santa wanted to include. What is Mrs. Claus's favorite treat? Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whoa. What's her favorite treat? Eh? What's her favorite <laughs> treat? <laughs> that is personal between me and my wife. And you, you do not, do not disrespect the sanctity of my marriage. You got it? Oh <laughs> my goodness. <sighs> I was I love, expecting I'm loving this. I was expecting Santa's candy cane <laughs> to be the answer there, but That's I guess That's sturdy. <laughs> oh, Santa's clean for Twitch. Yeah, Got clean, it. Clean. I'm clean image on Twitch. Good. I'm glad. <laughs> I didn't say anything, Santa, but I was like, uh, watch what you say cuz we're live, fucker. <laughs> right. There's no editing things out like usual. Oh, edit that out. Edit that out. Oh, I said a person's full name. Edit that out. <laughs> oh, whoops. Said something super offensive. We'll just edit that out. No. Whoops. So let's. I wanted to look real quick at the list of most popular games on Twitch. Wow. Number one is this game called Just Chatting. What? That's a I game? I mean... No, that's just a section where you're like, you just want to talk, you just want to talk to people, you, you go to just chatting. We're actually categorized right now, this broadcast, in the talk show and podcasts area. Oh, fun. Well, fun, yes, right? we are number a talk two, show and podcast. Number two, League of Legends. Number three, Counter-Strike Global Offensive, which is an old, old game. Hmm. Pretty hmm. funny. V number four, Valorant. Number five, Rust. Oh, Again, that that's fun. the game that I played that drops you into the world buck ass naked, and then you got to get food somehow. It was really hard. Do you have to like oh, kill no. an animal and then eat it? Yeah, skin you got to crush uh. things with rocks and find uh. food crates. I don't know. Number six. Here's a game I understand Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you should am, play that. A, That'd be a good one. I'm really good at that game. I am a master criminal. I like a Grand Slay Auto. I mean, wait, that doesn't make sense. Grand Theft Slay. I'm an idiot. <laughs> it's okay. I wish we could zoom in on his face. <laughs> yeah, I wish you could. What? Uh, okay, we agree then. Number seven, <laughs> The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. Nice. Woohoo! 
Woo! Got that one. Nice. Minecraft, World of Warcraft is still on here. Apex Legends, Call of Duty, lots of lots of stuff. So I got my work cut out for me of games that I have to play, but it's a fun time. Let me tell sure. you, playing games and hanging out with cool people. It really, I, I had a lot of fun this weekend. Good, good. Marzipan asks, what is God's favorite kind of edible? Hmm. 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 I like a good, strong edible that has like, like a, maybe like a, a green apple taste. <clears throat> yeah. A green yeah, apple taste. I also okay. like, um, like, uh, strawberry. Mm. And yeah. I, I can, so, yes. An apple teeny taste. We got some more comments here. Get Santa. <laughs> Santa, what do you think of this comment? Moo Man Graham says, get Santa in a hot tub. Ooh, hot. <laughs> mm, hot tub, eh? That would be cool. You know who in likes hot, hot tub. tubs? This guy. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't really work. <laughs> Jesus, are you pointing at Jesus? I don't know. Yeah, hot tub, because you're in... You're in a snowy environment, so right. Yeah, so it, it you could be, be in a hot tub. That'd be cool. Yeah. Um, this is a good time to remind everybody to follow our Twitch channel, please, <laughs> or not. Whatever. We we don't need it. We're so cool. No, fucking you follow. Know, we're not desperate or anything. Follow. Okay. Follow. All right. Uh, let's go. I want to read some more comments. <clears throat> Marzipan <clears throat> says, I have an epic beach bod. You're gosh darn right. Well, we'll I see do. on Thursday in the Discord. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and when we share news. Oh, yeah. here's Tooth Grater who just popped in and says, WTF. Um, Tooth Grater, what's thanks? the problem? What do you mean, need WTF? more to go off of than that. It Where looks is... like it's Chris. The Chris. Oh, the okay. Longtime God Pod listener, Chris. We love you, Chris. We do. Hope he, you're well. He says, LOL. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's move on and discuss some some serious news and stuff and see what's going on in the world. So I'm going to go to my news desk and see Whoa. what's going on here. Yeah. Okay. So here we have in the news, which I, I get from Reddit, <laughs> most, most like viewed news. California Governor Gavin Newsom demands records from textbook companies to see which are caving to Florida's extremist demands. Ooh, that's a good yeah. idea. Don't that you is think? a good idea. Yeah. Right. I mean, these poor textbook companies are going to have to start bending to these states, right? The heck with right. that. Good idea, Newsom. Santa, comment? I mean, yeah, I guess that's cool. <laughs> Santa, Santa's not one for the news, really. Yeah. You know, I don't like, I, it's very hard. I only read one newspaper, the North Pole Gazette. That oh, fucking, yeah. that fucking rag. It's never, it's always, <laughs> it's always just like, it's, it, what it is, is basically slandering me. Santa kills wow. two elves. Santa, you know, el elves on strike. All sorts of stuff. It's always like, oh, Donner threatens to quit. Now I is all this it. true? Is all this news true, Santa? No, I think that's why you tabloids. hate it. You I don't can't know. Believe the tabloids. We've sp <laughs> we've spoken to Hermie before, and it seems like uh, what uh, is being reported uh, in the North Pole uh, Gazette is actually uh, accurate. Uh, <laughs> just making noises uh, isn't gonna excuse <laughs> your behavior. Santa's, Santa's losing. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> I, I am with laughter. <laughs> okay, so let's move on. <laughs> Rev uh, Mojo Diane. is with you, Santa. They say it's a witch hunt. <laughs> right. Witch hunt, witch hunt. <laughs> Diane Feinstein resigned calls grow louder from Democrats. We need we need change. Oh my goodness. I have yeah. to agree. I mean, she was wheeled into the Senate and she was not looking good and she's uh, like a because damn she's been ill. She's been ill. It's time to retire. Let it go. Why do you want your legacy to go. end on this tragic Let... note? She's, yeah. She looks like a damn prune on wheels. Can't stand her. Oh, be nice. Wow. North Pole yeah, Gazette. Did you hear that? Yeah. Don't, I, there better resign. not be any reporters here from the North Pole Gazette. We got a new, a new person in the chat. 
Uh, Abyss, Abyssal Monkey says, Santa is the reason I was sent to the Witness Protection Program. Santa, what? Comments? Well, here's the thing. The Witness Protection Program sets you up real nice. You know? Like, I don't know. If I had to be in the Witness Protection Program, I feel like they... What they set you up in a new condo, you know? It's a pretty maybe, good deal, right? Yeah, it's not bad. If, what they must give you, like they must help pay for some expenses. No, I don't know. Yeah, That's... Sam Man Joe says, "Come here, Santa. I'll give you a massage." Hey, oh. hey, listen. Hey, you know what I have to say about that? A double bird. A du I'm flipping you the bird. Oh. oh. Well, you know what? Um, I think Peyton makes a good point here on the recent. Most recent episode, Mary Mags told us why Feinstein needs to stay for now, and it's because Biden needs to get all these judges through. So yeah, but yeah. couldn't they just reply? I, th I thought no, because um, that'll take a long time. I thought they could do it quickly, but all right. No, 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 no. And I believe Mary. Ho Hooter Scoot says, <laughs> "Clause Christ twenty four, baby." Woo Vote yeah, for us. Yeah, Vote for us. <laughs> Christ claws. and claws. Wait, 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 wait. We're wait, the wait, reason wait, 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 for wait. the season. Does this mean that that Santa Claus would be the president and Jesus would be would be vice? Oh, I guess so. Let's oh. go out campaigning. You, Jesus will go out campaigning. You can kiss the babies, and uh, I'll kiss the moms. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it makes sense to me. He gives, Santa gives you what you want. Jesus, you know, he brings the wine. Okay, mm. let's move on. Uh, oh, this news is so depressing. Let's. Here's a funny story. Lauren Boebert, defense husband, says he doesn't drink Bud Light. Oh, is this a? Oh, how is this oh, a defense okay. of what? What? What are we defending I here? I don't because know. She's getting divorced, and she's. Who's My that? husband never drank Bud Light. Well, good Representative for her. Lauren Boebert jumped to her husband's defense on Wednesday while also sliding Bud Light in a tweet about the couple's recently announced divorce. Ha! Mm -hmm. That way to use the whole Bud Light thing to, like, you know, try hey, and... you know, Lauren, let me tell you something. Lauren Boebert, if you're listening, I'm sorry, but, uh, divorced people? Automatically on the night. <laughs> 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 Oh, really? That's mean. Oh, that's fun. That's Look fun. at you. He's kind of dancing. Uh, you can have <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and then look at this from Fox News. Bud Light to launch like a camouflage bottle amid oh, transgender no. controversy. Oh, oh no. no. I remember the O'Flages. Yeah. Very nice Irish couple that lived on my street. <laughs> Camouflage <laughs> bottles. His wife. You know what, what are God? They gonna do? Are they gonna are they gonna have Bud Light wearing camo and like holding a AR fifteen and like listening to Kid Rock? Is yeah. that what they're gonna do now? Probably. You know what? Oh, sorry. You know what enrages <laughs> me about all of this? And I'm gonna put on my angry face for this moment. One, two, three. I nice. just just back in 2019, I went to a bar down on Earth. It was uh, a gay bar. And what did I find for sale? Rainbow Bud Light cans for Pride Month. Was mm -hmm. Kid Rock freaking out then? Was any other person on the right freaking out? No. But now, suddenly, having a trans spokesperson for five seconds is a major problem? Are you kidding me? I don't yeah. get it. Well, it's yeah, all fake more, nonsense. You know, they're way more angry about this <clears throat> subject than anything else. They're not even yeah, angry. They're just faking it. They're, they they're angry feigning at, outrage. They weren't angry at Bud Light when people were drinking and driving and killing families. Fucking Amen. Stuff. Yeah, that's a good point. That, everybody's okay with that because that's all part of the plan. I'm going but, on let's... eBay right now and buying a Bud Light rainbow can. I bet somebody you is buy selling it. beer them. on eBay? Well, what if it's empty? I just want an empty Bud Light rainbow hey, can. Um, uh, just really quick, Tooth Grader wrote, any girls in here, which is which is the perfect way to scare girls into <laughs> to not making themselves known. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Mm. What is this? A dating app? Uh, what is this? A club? Girls in here, girls in here. <laughs> he says, "My fault." Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh God! You turned yourself off real quick. There you go. Okay, I'm back. Yeah. Uh, moving on in the news, Oscar Mayer renames iconic hot dog on wheels to Frank Mobile because. Oh. The world could not handle the name Wienermobile any longer. That is so sad. <laughs> We've yeah. canceled the word Wiener, mm. I guess. Pretty stupid. Yeah. Mm. Pretty, oh, look, now I'm in the middle. Oh. That's appropriate, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay. So uh, what else do I got in the stupid goddamn news? Yeah. Uh, lots of Lots of really, like infuriating shit. Let me get to something that's kind of funny. Okay. Besides the Wienermobile. <clears throat> <laughs> I was hoping that was going to be a pride-related story since no, it's no, coming no, no. up. Bizarre oh, photo. The of, yeah. Bizarre photo of Elon Musk kissing a robot leaves the internet baffled. <laughs> but not all is as it seems. Is, is it a... Oh, look at that. Oh. There he is. Is that real? <laughs> I don't know. That's what we're going to find out. Is that an AI? These are AI images, right? I'm going to say that's AI. AI. Oh, look that's at all definite, the that's def yeah. <laughs> Oh, baby. Uh, I mean, that's definitely AI. He is not this thin. Yeah, I'd say so. Yeah. Uh, this post is to clarify the dangers of AI. Guys, this guy's not a human. This is a... Okay. So, it's AI. Yeah, I mean, could have fooled me for a second or two. But yeah, really. that wouldn't wouldn't put it would it wouldn't put that past him. Okay, um, you know what? Screw the news. Let's move on to more fun stuff. The news is boring. What is it? A holiday week here in uh, 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 down there in America? <laughs> I thought yeah. of a horrible joke, and I'm not going to say it because we're live. Good. Nice. Keep it to yourself. Let's see <laughs> if there's any. What's happening in the comments here? Mm-hmm. 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 Welcome, Zuffcud. Oh, yeah. Hello. Look at this. New person. Welcome, Hello. Zuffcud. A Trump a lawyer Trump? ratted on him. Hmm. I don't know what... That's a head scratcher. That's a reference to. Abysmank says, I thought God liked it in the middle. Yeah. Hey, now. Hey... So, uh, tell us in the chat, humans, how are you enjoying this live broadcast of The God Pod on the twitch.tv slash The God Pod? Let us know what you think, if you're enjoying this, on a scale of 1 to 10, what you want more of, what you want less of, and we'll adjust fire. Adjust I fire? See, oh, and also, ask all your questions. Oh, here's a new person. Kara Coffee says, it's strange. There's AI on Snapchat, too, creating me if I want it. Nope. <laughs> Kara oh. Coffee, I'll have a cup of uh, coffee, you know. With, hey, yeah. You, you take your sugar? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here comes some of the feedback on how we're doing. You want to hear it, gang? Okay. Give it to us. All right. Sam says, love it. Aww. Hooter Scoot says 10 Ooh, out of 10. Nice. Thanks, Hooter Scoot. Mooman Graham says, good stuff, guys. Kev Larson says, I watch Twitch. I don't listen to podcasts, so this is perfect. Ooh, wow. Yeah. Uh, so nice. Jira says, how many people are trying to be God today? Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. Not that many. They're just trying to speak for me. Um, Rev Moho says, you should have Darwin as a guest sometime. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, we'll call mm. him up. We'll call him up. <laughs> Princess Kimberly says, this made my morning. Mm. Fiona says, I thought there would be more pontificating. Hmm. Oh. Please, <clears throat> please expand upon that, Fiona, and tell us, what does pontificating mean to you? Yeah, what do you mm. want us to uh, p-tiff about? <laughs> <laughs> I think just some more strong opinions, maybe. I mean, I went off on Bud Light for a second. Oh, yeah. okay. We're just and having too much fun. In this new, and and then Abysmal says, "Well, at least on here I can get the content, unlike on Facebook." Exactly. Oh, yeah. And, and I just want to take this moment out to say, 
Um, fuck Facebook. Hey, yeah. fuck you, Facebook. Hey, flipping the double birds. Fuck you, Mark wow. Zuckerberg. Not just right one. here, buddy. Right here. You fucking prick, ya. We want double birds again. Well, I did it. So oh, okay. <laughs> it's Team W33D says, is Santa a special guest? No, actually, if you can believe it, Santa is on all the time. <laughs> yes. Uh, you know, I, 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 I am, although I am, I will say, I am, I can't, my controls are, I am pretty special. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> blah, 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 yes. blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm we just love Santa, so much don't fun. we, folks? Yes, yeah. of course. We That's love why he's here all the time. We love Santa. Getty says five stars. Will recommend. Nice. And Max says you're doing a great job. Oh, thanks. This is this is honestly the energy I needed to get through the next uh, twenty minutes. <laughs> a little booster. Or however long. Yeah, uh, Santa and Jesus will stay, <laughs> hang out. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Rev Mo Mojo says, I think pontificating is for the Pope. Well. That's some, that's some look, extra. Yeah. Sorry. I mean, look yeah, at who no, you're you, talking no, to no, right no, no, now. No, 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 I think that was some excellent pontificating, Rebel Joe. <laughs> You've got God, Jesus, and Santa here. I mean, come on, let us pontificate. Now that is pontificate. a holy trinity if I've ever seen one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, hey. Matt W. says, well done, Ireland, for finding Meta 1.2 billion euros. Wow. Oh, yeah. Good. good for you, Ireland. Very merry Monday for Ireland. Took a, took a break from the old bottle. Got something done. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. All right. Now, we're going to mo move on to a new segment here. This is the Adventures of Young Jesus. <gasps> Ooh. Yay! So on the last time Jesus was on, Cheshire Cat asked, Dear Jesus, would you share some of your young adventures of Jesus? <clears throat> so we uh, we went back and found some. We did. And, and we here did. they are. <laughs> Number one, the marvelous miracle of the lost kitten. Ah, oh, classic. Mm -hmm. So, that, yeah. Should I recall the story? You you tell it, Jesus. That yeah. was a two-parter, if I am not mistaken. <laughs> <laughs> a young Jesus encounters a distressed little girl whose beloved kitten has gone missing. <laughs> Using his compassion and innate connection with animals, Jesus embarks on a quest to find the lost feline, employing his miraculous abilities com to communicate with creatures along the way well you can talk to creatures i didn't realize of course you were, i like, can dr doolittle oh yeah was this All written by a, was this written by a um a uh am i frozen disciple i think this you is, are these frozen. are real stories oh, boy. santa well these sorry are all actual things that happened that jesus is sharing it's this is true. like the adventures of young indy oh I, I love that i guess i'm frozen <laughs> for a few minutes hey deal with it <laughs> yeah, we're smiting Santa, you. Santa froze. <laughs> we're new at this. Hey, yeah, keep it on me. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> really Great video. <laughs> you might need to. Yeah, I don't yeah, know. you Let might need to. <laughs> Re <laughs> Let me tell another back. story. I yeah. can recall another one: the spectacular sandcastle contest. Oh, this was a good one. Young Jesus and his friends participated in a seaside sandcastle contest. Despite facing strong competition, Jesus showcases his divine creativity and craftsmanship, transforming a simple sandcastle into an architectural marvel, leaving everyone in awe. Yeah, I love I, a I feel good like, sandcastle. I feel like that that was unfair, how you were using your powers as a young lad to impress everyone. Well, look, bitches, don't compete with me. You know what you're going to be up against. You so... were so good at sports. You know, mm -hmm. little league. I was great and really excelled. Soccer. You were, you were amazing on the diving and swimming team. Hey, that's what yeah. the elves play. Little league. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Santa, Santa looks really unimpressed by this these is stories. A, this is actually a very good neutral face for just <laughs> it is. listening along. 
<laughs> You're just like observing what what's going on. Santa, yeah. Santa Ain't nothing really froze. wrong with that that much. <laughs> yeah, Santa's good. Santa, if you want to leave and come back, that's fine. What now? Why would I try. do a thing like that? <laughs> uh, you know, turn wait, it off, wait. turn it back on again. Hold on. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. It's up to you. Oh, hold on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, oh, Let him on, work on it. I'll read another. S <laughs> Sam says, I'm laughing so hard, I'm crying. Thank you. <laughs> this Thank is the you. funniest Santa's ever been when he can't move or speak. It's <laughs> oh. Um, I mean, so yeah, that's a head scratcher. <laughs> I, wish I, I wish I could. I wish I could uh, agree with you there. <laughs> So there was uh, this right. other story, the Enchanted Forest Exploration. That was when I ventured into a mystical forest, which was rumored to house magical beings. And alongside my curious companions, I encountered talking animals, mischievous fairies, and a wise old tree with ancient wisdom. Wow. Through my gentle nature and profound insights, I helped bring harmony to the forest and its inhabitants. Wow, so that was like a Snow White type of thing. Yeah, it's giving me some Zelda vibes too. I, it was a, it was a good time. I maybe the it's original like inspiration for Lord of the Rings as well. Snow Jesus. Yeah. Or you're Jesus right. Snow White. White is the best example. Yeah. <laughs> and then, oh, this one is very me. There was the Great Fisherman's Feast, and in a fishing village, I joined a group of struggling fishermen who had had no luck in their catch. And with my extraordinary knowledge of the sea, I guided them to an abundant catch, turning a disappointing day into a joyful feast for the entire community. Oh, yeah, I never liked that, that story. That one was uh, kind of like what you did in the Bible with the fishes. Yeah, and folks, these aren't funny. These are more like, you know, children's tales. Certainly not. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for telling me what to laugh at. <laughs> these are as funny as Santa's current stagnant image yeah i <laughs> think it's pretty funny you're not wrong i think it's fine oh that's obs and I think these are great jesus lastly again very me the curious case of the vanishing bread that was where i again as young me with my insatiable curiosity investigated the mysterious disappearance of freshly baked loaves of bread from the local bakery and i used my keen observation skills and resourcefulness to unravel the secret behind the vanishing bread, bringing justice and a valuable life lesson to life. Wow. Wow. Thank you. That was great, Jesus. Those were some good times. You know, yeah. you did all the things, all your best hits, really. You know, there was the, the fish and the bread. <clears throat> the forest, right. the sand. Helping the, the forest princesses and hey stuff. i got a good one i got a good one hey i know it's the north pole but that don't mean i like to be frozen right <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one that was that was not Is a Santa head scratcher frozen because mrs claus shoved a snowball up his stinker oh, oh. hey fan of the show <laughs> <laughs> Dang, great great Deep comment cut. up dude <clears throat> oops santa logged off mrs claus issues Oh. oh, Kev Larson says this should be a TV series. It is. We're on twitch.tv. <laughs> Make sure to follow. <clears throat> I know that uh, we've had ideas for television shows, too. So if anybody's listening, actually, no, because of the writer's so, strike. Never so mind. says Jesus' well, stories sound like Hallmark intros rather than actual stories when yeah, really do. i guess then you're saying the bible sounds like hallmark stories we need the, your stories need more violence well Jesus. look everybody whoa i just leaned into the camera my apologies um look once you tell the crucifixion story i mean where do you go from there it, it was too triggering that one story i have to keep things simple here on the show i can't uh share any more traumatic stories come on i'm still in therapy over the crucifixion Overlord Tomala says the stories of Hallmark Jesus. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, it's nice when Jesus goes back to his hometown of Bethlehem at Christmas time and just like, you know, falls in love. Mm, it reminds me of a dance that goes like this. 
<laughs> oh, Santa. Oh, well. We'll figure out what's wrong with your... Oh, Jesus, are you dancing? I said, oh, well. <laughs> hey, nice. quit bragging. Yeah. You quit bragging. Oh. See, Poor I'm pointing Santa. at you. Getting smited by internet. Uh, in case you're listening at home, we're, we're still moving and grooving, and Santa is... Fr- <laughs> Completely frozen for like 10 minutes. Poor guy. Maybe I have to close OBS. No. You have to close. Yeah, try closing your programs and restarting. Oh, That'll nice. help. I would try the other one. I think uh, that one might be. Do what? Yeah, maybe oh, yeah. it's both. I don't know. Try them both. Why not? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> we got a question here from. Find me. Yes. Zuffcud says, Jesus, have you ever met Brian? You know, Met from Brian. the wife of Brian. Oh, you know what? Uh, no, I was I was never invited to the set. I'm sorry to say. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's a shame. Great movie though. God did make yeah. me watch it. I resisted for a really long time, and I, I finally did. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You're not and, wrong. Uh, we got. Let's see what else we got. Holy Sp- Hooter the Scoot says, Holy Spirit said she had a dream about Santa a few episodes ago. Do I smell budding romance? Ooh. Ooh. Hey. Maybe. Don't tell Mrs. Claus. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah. Maybe Holy Spirit could be Santa's goodbye. Or maybe do tell her, break her fucking heart. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Tell her on Christmas. Bethlehem, not Nazareth. So confused. Yeah, where, where, what is your hometown? Jesus, I don't remember. My you were born hometown, in Bethlehem, Cleveland. Lived in Nazareth. Cleveland no, rocks. No, my hometown was uh, Bethlehem. Fiona says, "How long did it take them holes to heal?" Ah, wow! Wow! Bang! Dirty. Um, FYI, they're still there. They haven't healed, and yeah, they're a lot of fun in the bedroom. <laughs> Pretty gross. <laughs> Uh wow. Always look on the bright side of life. This is going fantastic. All Always right, look got? on the bright side of life. Did it don't get copyright infringement? We're what just Jesus, for fun. let's move on to what would Jesus do? No. We got some real head scratchers here for you today, Jesus. That's a head scratcher. No. Yeah. Yes. No. They're All so right, triggering. number one from our patron Draken Black Knight asks, "What would Jesus do for a Klondike bar?" <laughs> you know what? Summer is uh, coming to America. I follow their seasonal schedule, and I would get down with the Klondike bar this time of year. So yeah, I would do pretty would much you... anything for a Klondike bar, anything? if I'm being honest. Anything. anything? Well. I would do anything for love, but I wouldn't do that. And by that, I mean a woman. Oh, okay. So you'd do anal for a Klondike bar, but not... With a man, yeah. yeah. Vaginal, okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right, exactly. Let's get this correct. Uh, next question for Jesus on what would Jesus do? This is a good one. C2 asks, Jesus is stranded on an iceberg without his powers. <gasps> he only has the clothes on his back. A knife and a lone seal that has claimed on, climbed onto the iceberg to escape a pod of killer whales. Okay. They have been returning periodically to try and knock the seal off the iceberg. To Ooh. make matters even worse, it's been a week and, and Jesus is starving now and worried the next killer whale attack could knock him off into the freezing water. Would Jesus, would Jesus kill and eat the seal to keep from starving and give some of it to the whales to make them go away? Jesus, care to comment? Oh, wow. This is a tough question. Okay, but you said I got a knife. I've got the clothes on my back. Can I cut up the clothes on my back, make a sail that I tie to the knife, attach it to the iceberg, and then float to safety. Uh, hey, 
guys, it kind of no. works again. Oh yeah. Oh, sort hey, of. Santa. I can move my <laughs> mouth, and I can every now and then go like, hey, hey, put me on the big screen for a second. <laughs> Hold on. Here, put me on the thing. Men You're catatonic. Sent, center me. Okay. Ask me a question. How are you doing, Santa? I don't know. <laughs> He seems so lost right now. He's just staring into the abyss. He's in a black hole. He's he's in the sunken place. Oh, poor Santa. He looks oh, like he's I've made a huge mistake. He can... You look like you've been brainwashed by a cult. Yeah, you do. Hey Santa. hey, Santa, what do you think about Scientology? I don't know much about it. <laughs> he's possessed. Ask me Somebody something else. Seen... Now it's a great time for Ask Santa. Center me! <laughs> okay. Someone asking a question. Here you go. Has Santa had any vaccines lately? Hmm. <laughs> um. Not recently. <laughs> Thanks for well, asking. To everybody listening, you have to tune into this live. You can watch it later, of course, but make sure you tune Santa in live on Twitch. Or he can not move really. his arms, but not his face. Now he basically looks like completely catatonic. <laughs> Santo, what the f is up with the penguins? Says Moon Man Graham. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> This shit is crazy. So Jesus, you successfully skated out on answering the question again, what, right? I and realize just, it wasn't the strongest answer, but I was trying yeah, to turn my clothes into a thing, sail. Jesus, Jesus huh. you have the easiest answer in front of you to this. You can walk on water. Oh, as soon as you Jesus, said that first part, I realized this? it too. Oh. You could turn you could turn the killer whale's blood to wine, they die. You could eat some of the killer whale. You could grab that baby seal. I don't want to kill the whale. Okay, no, yeah. You you don't have to. Just grab that baby seal, put it on your back like it was a crucifix, and walk across the water to safety. Yes. Tie it to my back with a knife. You have so... Oh, wait a minute. Chaka says, Godpod, the question dictated his loss of powers. Damn it. Oh, you're right. Damn Thank okay. you. Well, in that case, Jesus, you have no choice but to club that baby seal. Mm. No! <laughs> it's for the good oh, of mankind. The seal was so cute. I don't want to. You, you know what? You know what? You can bring it back to life once you get free. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. okay. This is like Superman turning the planet around to turn back time. If I could turn back time. Well, that was a tough question. Good job, C2. Fioma says, how many followers would I need to bring into the fold in order to get a person whacked? Wow. Whoa. Let's, Whoa. Let's talk offline. Hey, wait, wait. Do Go to me again? Just and 100. Ask the, and ask the question. How, how many followers would Fiona need to bring to get somebody whacked? Oh. Hey, man. I don't want any trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Santa's doing his best. Santa Santa got injected with something. Um <laughs> He's gonna pass out and fall over in a minute. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you are. <laughs> Just concerned about you. Well yeah, yeah, yeah. Well what else do we got here today? Um how are we doing on time? Well eight minutes. I think we can look to future news real quick. Um, if you just want to, well, if it's out, if this episode's coming out Thursday, I believe Ron DeSantis is going to be announcing he's running for president this week. Oh no. That sucks. I know. uh, Maybe something funny will happen. Like he'll shit himself. (laughs) During his announcement. announcement. That'd be so freaking funny. (laughs) That (laughs) What was that, Santa? So that would be so freaking funny. (laughs) You know, you know what I, if I was laughing, you know what I would do? Like, I, if I was, if I was in the audience, center me! Yeah. I would go, whoa, <laughs> you see, y'all see that? Y'all see that? Yeah. Like, shoot himself. That was funny. Yeah. That was worth a solo camera <laughs> angle. 
Well, Jesus, make it happen. Wait, we do have an update oh, here. Oh, wait. It was what? Oh, what? What's the update? Uh, yeah. Sorry. Uh, get a person walked off, Fiona well, like said. Walked off. Not whacked off. Oh. What does walk off mean? And well, I know what it means in baseball. <laughs> We've got a walk off. <laughs> yeah. I know what it means in Zoolander. Uh... <clears throat> um, yeah. Team 3WD says, Santa is the hor horror story of Botox. Look at this That's boat. Right. Look at my new boat. Oh, congrats. <laughs> That's an excellent point, team. It's, it's over is there. That it I'm does gonna... look like Santa just has had a bunch of Botox. <laughs> he got into Mrs. Claus's Botox boat. stash. Look at my boat. <laughs> Princess Kimberly says he looks like he just got his wisdom teeth out. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Catatonic. <laughs> Uh... <clears throat> Again, desperate question here from Moo Man. Santa, my pal loves Christmas and she celebrates it with penguins. What the actual fuck is that all about? I don't like your tone, but <laughs> um, I will say, what, the penguin? We love penguins. And um, what do you mean she celebrates it with penguins? What does like, that mean? I think... That that's like the main theme of the decoration of the Christmas thing is oh penguins. okay well I I mean what are you what are you asking me you got to be a little more specific with your questioning I mean I am a legend <laughs> I One guess day only. because th this I don't understand this abyssal monkey says Santa for president Jesus for VP God for Secretary of Defense. What the hell? This seems like backwards to me. Like I should be uh at least the president. VP. Yeah. I should be the president if not the VP. Well, I guess this is a reference to the earlier comment about right. Santa and Christ Christ Clause 2024. Santa can be the Secretary of the Treasury. Hey guys, look. Look at me. Yeah. Look, I'm in my Hey, solo me. Hey, I'm in my favorite coffee house. Hello. <laughs> Hey! I'll, I'll How many times Santa, Santa has said has said this episode? Give me main camera. Hey! Give me, <laughs> hey. It's spotlight. It sums me. Up, spotlight. Give me the spotlight. I know I'm. I can't even move, and I'm catatonic. But Dude, I still deserve the spotlight. It, when I walked in here and I saw all the crazy names for coffees, Venti Grande, Trenta, I went, hmm, that's a head scratcher. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. Yeah. Santa's got like one hand tied behind his back. He's still making it work. Oh. Uh, cool. So, yeah, Moo Man, we're just as confused about this penguin connection as you. I think your friend just really likes penguins, probably yeah. because they're cute. And and someday you'll find it, the penguin connection. So <laughs> <laughs> yes. I have yes. some campaign slogans for Santa and I. I, I like this skins. one. Make America Jolly Again, Santa Claus 2024. Oh, nice. Naughty or nice, choose nice, Santa for president. Oh, that's really good. Slaying challenges, spreading cheer, Santa Claus for America. Ooh, Slaying like is spelled S-L-E-I. Were these yeah. written by guild members? Yeah, uh, no, of course not. <laughs> and definitely not written by chat GPT either. I can't, yeah, yeah, you're right. I can't you tell. You would never. A mm, sack relatable. full of promises. Santa Claus for a prosperous future. Oh, I thought, I thought you had a sack full of shitty slogans. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Make America Jolly is pretty good. That's not yeah, bad. come on. <laughs> you can't do much better than that. All right, fine. I'll stop. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here's a new question from a new... Picardix says, in Sweden, we used to have the Yule Goat before Santa took over. What did you do with the goat, Santa? The what? The, the Yule, Yule goat. goat? Man, that's uh Let me tell you something. That's uh <laughs> I'm confused by that. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were gonna say that's a head scratcher. You threw me. Yeah, you yeah. thought so, huh? I ain't yeah, so predictable. It. Just because I'm frozen doesn't mean I'm so yeah. goddamn predictable. <laughs> I thought you couldn't change your facial expression, but you just did. Dude, uh, yeah, I freaking can. 
<laughs> you can. Give me angry. Oh. All right, nice. Now give me sexy. <laughs> sexy. sexy. Okay, how's this? <laughs> <laughs> That's yes. the face. He makes when he's yes, trying to woo Mrs. Claus. Yeah, that, yeah. What's up? Works every time. Dude, that, that gets her nice and snowy. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, well, you know, I think Holy Spirit is going to be coming online soon uh, in coming weeks. And oh, great. this has been so much fun to be live on Twitch with my bros and, you know, have fun talk a little bit there's not much going on in the news you know worth discussing these days it's like DeSantis and Trump and blah blah evil fucks that everybody hates and I don't know what is there the Bud Light blah 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 so I really enjoyed hearing the young adventures of Jesus and um hanging out with Santa even though he's clearly just catatonic right now i'm worried about him i don't know we'll figure it out the technical glitches along the way i just thank you all for joining us and you know having some fun here on a merry monday and it's merry just merry monday it's been fantastic if you're listening to this in the future make sure to follow us on twitch.tv slash the God Pod. It's time for blessings and smites. Yes. 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 Jesus, do you uh, want to go first? I want to bless the following campla- campaign Excuse slogan. Me? I want to bless the following campaign slogan for Jesus 2024. Love thy neighbor, lead the nation. Jesus 2024. I'll win with that one for sure. Nice. Do you have any campaign slogans for God? Uh, no, because it's Christ Claus 2024. Okay, how about oh. God 2024? Have it Yahweh. <laughs> okay, fine. That one's um, always good. Um, <laughs> God, vote for me or I'll smite you. Yeah. God, vote for me or I'll flood the earth again. Just threaten people. That I should tell do that it. you're coming up with these yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a comedian. Not, I'm just a humble Jesus. Not leaving it to the computer. <laughs> no, no. Not what is wrong with your arm, Jesus? Oh, I'm it's just stretching. In one position. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's fine. It's just. Do you there have you go. like a carpal tunnel? Okay. I was I was just stretching it out. My 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 pit was uh, feeling a little stinky, so I was airing Gross. it out. Oh, yeah. Okay. I want to bless all of God's video game streaming and uh, these ideas that we came up with today. I want I want to see you play uh, all of these games, especially Untitled Goose Game, and I want to, really? uh, yeah, and and Sim City, and, and and Legend of Zelda. A heck yeah! Please play Legend of Zelda. I'm having a great time with the new game, and I want to bless Santa. You know, even when he's frozen, he's still bringing the funny. <laughs> yeah, man. yeah, even when he's frozen, he still gets it done somehow. And Somehow I'm I find sure... this even more amusing than uh, the Santa that can move. <laughs> really? No, I smited, Santa. Not me. I miss moving Santa. But I, I um, I'd like to no. dedicate a, a blessings and smite to a a, a a listener, a fan of ours. Um, can I say? No, don't say their name. Please oh, okay. don't. Right, I I, I did share with Santa just for context this weekend. I sent. Santa a screenshot. There, I think there's at least one person who really, really hates Santa's consistent blessings and smites. Like, <laughs> really despises. Like, when they know that the Santa blessings and smites are coming, they stop listening because they're so tired of your shtick, Santa. So, ah! just with prefacing that, you know, that's their right. Not everyone's going to love your shit, you know? No, the, everyone should. Um, but um, <laughs> but just I love for it. you, pal. You know who you are. <laughs> Today, I would like to bless the good children. Aw. But I would like to smite. 
the naughty, naughty children. <laughs> How are you doing in the desk? Oh my god! <laughs> Even frozen, he's still good. He he's was still like pretty good. The groping the desk or something. It's so disturbing. <laughs> yeah, it's like massive. Is, if you're uh, watching this on Twitch. Dot TV slash the God Pod. It's like Santa is beating oh, off the table. Oh, 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 oh my God. God. Oh, my this God. Is, this is craziness. Oh, that is so this funny. is the best oh, thing ever. <laughs> Just keep doing that until you can move again. You can't okay. see the tears, but I'm crying. I promise you. I'm crying. Uh, right oh, now. look at I want. You know what I want to bless? Besides what? how much fun this is to go live on Twitch, I think we should do this every time. What do you think, gang? <laughs> sure. <laughs> it's been a smashing success, though. I think sure. it's so fun. So we're I think we're going to record whenever we can live on Twitch from here on out. And people can, they can watch it live. They can listen to the podcast when it comes out. They can do whatever they want. But uh, this is so cool and funny. It is. And like it's great to be able to react with people in real time as they're witnessing us. We've got some blessings and smites from the audience, if you can believe it. This is going to be a first. Oh, fun! Because, oh, that's yeah. fun. Let's see here. Uh, Peyton says Jesus is just eye candy. Wait, no, that's not a blessing. Hey, now I call that Fiona a blessing. Fiona says he has a a good um slogan for me for running for president. God damn it! Vote for God. <laughs> Which I really like. I Give like me it. Maine. God damn it, vote for God. Shouldn't it be I damn it? <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> uh, we're working on it, okay? Yeah. <laughs> we're workshopping that one. Anyway, thank you for that. Um, let's see. Let's, let's find some blessings and smites, Jesus. Let me put on my reading glasses. I uh, found one here. Marzipan said, I want to smite Ron DeSantis and his goofy ass battles battles in Florida. Amen, Amen. to that. Yep. Marzipan Pan also says, I want to bless the pod. Y'all awesome. Keep it up. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um uh, oh. And lots of lots of oh, and a smite from Marzipan. And I want to smite Ron DeSantis. Oh, you just said that. I read one. that. Duh. Yeah. How about Mars this one from Marzipan? Mars They're dropping about, all of them. What about Jupiter uh, Pan? I want to bless Jesus and his epic beach bod. Thank you so much. Jesus, can you take off your robe and show us your body right now? Um, no. Save it for Thursday. <laughs> Save it for Thursday and oh, the yeah. nude beach. <laughs> Sam says, I... Wait. Nope, I'm not hitting the right button. Sam says, bless Santa... For preside and smile, Lil D. Must be president. Oh, president. Of course. Oh. Jira says Jesus wouldn't sanction smites. <laughs> well, anyway, thanks, everybody. And um, I guess it's my turn for blessings and smites. I would like to bless all of you for joining us today and tuning in live and for following our Twitch and for continuing to support the God pod through these crazy times that we're all going through. And as for smiting, as for smiting, uh, Fiona says me, me smite me. So, Whoa. okay, Fiona, be careful what you wish for. Okay. Cause I'm how would you like you it? Now. Slow and painful or quick and easy? <laughs> yeah. Be careful what you wish for. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, it's time for your new commandment. All right, here we go. <clears throat> Let me put on my sunglasses for this. Oh, that's cool. New commandment. Thou shalt follow God on Twitch. Thou shalt engage with the divine streams. Thou shall hitteth the follow button. And thou shall spreadeth the divine hilarity to all mortal realms. For it is written, embrace the almighty streamer and share the laughter of the heavens with the world. The Lord has spoken. Woo! Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye, bye everybody. Thanks for stopping by. 
This was so fun. Bye. See you next time. Bye bye now. Bye bye. Later. <laughs> He's brushing his face. <laughs> brushing my beard while I clean the table. Ha ha ha!